Okay, so we know this. The pandemic has made recent times especially hard. We still have some exciting things happening here in the River City, though. A local chef will soon be on Chopped Sweets on the Food Network, so people all across the country, even the world, are going to get to see her and her work. And right now, corporate pastry chef for Black Sheep's Restaurants, Rebecca Reed, joins us via Zoom from her home kitchen to talk about her experience on the episode and what people can expect. And you've got some surprises for us. Good morning. Good to see you, Rebecca. How are you? Good morning. Thank you so much for having me on. So look, you know that I'm a big fan of your work, specifically Thank you. You know, eating it. <laughs> That's what I like to do. I like to eat your work. And uh, when we talked a couple months ago, you said, hey, look, something exciting is on the horizon. That's what happened. Tell me about being on this show. Being on Chopped was so much fun. It was also a long, stressful day. The whole premise of this show is that you're given a box of mystery ingredients. You open up the box and then you have to go and make a dish in 30 or 45 minutes. And that time goes by so fast. You kind of go into it thinking that it will be a hard day and you try to go in with a plan, but oh my goodness, it was all of that and even more. So you are competing with chefs from across the country who are also very talented, just like you. It was a real honor to even just make it to the show. And it was it was a ton of fun to actually get to rub shoulders with some of those people and to get to sit in the break rooms and just talk about our industry and the things that were going on. Okay, so I know that you are Jacksonville through and through. You actually are the corporate pastry chef for three restaurants here, or say black sheep as well as bellwether so for you this was about you know putting the river city on the map with the culinary experience because you, you hear about miami and charleston and new york and maybe savannah jacksonville doesn't always get that much credit for its food i know it and i really just want to change that i think that we're doing awesome things between the restaurant group i work at the talented chefs that I work with every day and other people in our town. And there's so much to Jacksonville. I really just wanted to have that spotlight shine on us down here so other people would get excited and get to see some of the cool things that we do have going on down here. All right, speaking of cool things, I'm sorry, but my eyes are looking down at those cookies in the cookie dough. Big fan right there. Uh, give us a couple tips for other people to maybe, you know, get a little closer to your level. So when I was thinking about my whole chopped experience, it was so much fun and having those mystery ingredients, kind of like just looking in your pantry and trying to come up with something was pretty stressful and pretty fast and intense. So I was trying to think of ways that I could help out the home cooker. You know, people at home, if you have unexpected company, people come in or if you're anything like me, whenever people come into my house, they're just expecting cookies or something sweet. <laughs> so a little trick that I like to share is whenever I make something like chocolate chip cookies or your favorite type of cookie, I'll double the batch and I will just take my cookie dough scoop it out and freeze my scoops of cookie dough. I'll hide them in my freezer and then whenever somebody comes over, all I have to do is go in there and pull out the cookie dough and then I can have freshly baked cookies in no time. And I know people are always impressed and then I'm a whole lot less stressed out too if I have that hidden in there. Yeah, work smart, not hard. <laughs> That's there you right. Go. I love it. You know, this is where I, I, I really don't like these Zoom interviews because normally I would be eating them, but I, I, I can't do that. Thank you I so much. I appreciate it. One. Really quickly, two things. When can people watch and where can people learn more from you? Please tune in Tuesday, August 25th on the Food Network at 10 p.m. to watch me compete on Chopped Sweets. And if you'd like to hear more about what I'm up to, especially virtual cooking classes, check out my website, ChefRebeccaReed.com. All right. Chef Rebecca, thank you so much. Did you win? You're not going to answer that question. We're just going well, to have to wait until Tuesday Tuesdays. night. Fingers crossed for you. We appreciate you. Thank you. <laughs>